Hello guys, it's Johnny Time and welcome to another decentralized finance tutorial. Today we will learn how to bridge tokens and assets from Ethereum blockchain to Harmony One blockchain. If you want to get started with Harmony One, maybe with DeFi Kingdoms, which is an amazing DeFi game, yield farming, uh, NFT, metaverse, play to earn game. So this is your tutorial to get started with Harmony One if you have some funds on Ethereum. And in order to uh, bridge the funds from Ethereum to Harmony One, we're gonna use bridge.harmony1 slash ERC20. But before we start, make sure to subscribe and click the bell button. So anytime I post these videos, you can watch them and learn and become DeFi masters here with me in Johnny Time. Also, consider joining my new Discord community. We're gonna create a new community that's gonna learn and evolve and help each other. We have a lot of channels there, support, suggestions. If you want to suggest any videos, farms and pools, stable coins, NFT, metaverse, etc. Click the link in the description below and join the Discord community to get faster access to me, Johnny Time, and to our community together. Now, if you want to bridge your tokens, you go to Horizon by Harmony, bridge.harmony1 slash ERC20, click here, Ethereum, connect your MetaMask wallet. And I want to say that Harmony1 is also EVM compatible network. So it means that it has like same like BSC scan, Ether scan, Poly scan. It has Harmony1 scan. So it's very, very similar to your Ethereum wallet. You're gonna choose what kind of token you want to choose. So in that case, I'm gonna choose choose ERC20 and make sure that your wallet is connected. You can see this is just a temporary wallet that I don't use just for the example. And then you can choose the token that you want to bridge. I tried just three hours ago to bridge some DAI tokens and it worked quite well. Also, I have liquidity in SushiSwap on Harmony 1 on DAI. So I was able to swap my DAI tokens for, for Jewel or for One or any other tokens on the Harmony One ecosystem. So I just tried DAI. You can try other tokens, maybe USDC, maybe USDT, but I tried to bridge some DAI and it worked quite fast. Then you're gonna put here your diamond that you want to bridge. In that case, this, this is just an empty wallet, so I don't have anything here, and paste your ETH address. So in order to paste your ETH address, you're basically gonna open your MetaMask account and then copy the account. This is the same account, you're gonna have the same account on the Harmony One blockchain because again, it's EVM compatible. So you're gonna copy and paste the same address unless you want to send the funds to another address. It's another option, but the best way I think, or you can also just click use my address. So this will use the same address that you have right here on the top, the wallet that is connected to the uh, Web 3.0 application. Now we're gonna click here next. All right now, I don't have um, any, um, basically, I don't have, wait, I'm in the wrong network. Make sure you are on the Ethereum network. Oh, I'm on the right network. I just just don't, don't have any DAI tokens. But once you click next, there are gonna be four different steps. The first step is approving the spending of the DAI token by the Harmony One smart contracts on Ethereum blockchain. And you will approve it. It will, again, it's Ethereum, so the gas are quite high, but I paid for these transactions around $16. So approving, spending the DAI tokens. Then the second transaction would be to bridge the tokens. It was additional $20. So I paid in total around $40 for this whole bridge process on Ethereum. And then you will have to wait for 13 confirmation. It has a nice like loading uh, uh, status that shows you what, how many blocks you need to wait. Uh, so be patient, it will take around 30 minutes. And then eventually the, 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 the tokens will be minted on the Harmony One side. So if we go to Google and then we search for Harmony, Harmony scan, or you can just actually click here your wallet and click here and view on Etherscan, but it will actually, yeah, it open Etherscan, but you need to change your network to Harmony One. So once you change it to Harmony Mainnet and you click, it will open explorer.harmony1 slash address, explorer.harmony.1 slash address slash your wallet address. It's the same Ethereum wallet address that you have because again, it's EVM network right now. Um, I don't have anything in this wallet. So it redirected me to the base Harmony Blockchain Explorer, very similar to Etherscan or BSC scan. And then eventually the tokens, the DAI tokens will be minted on the Harmony One side. The cool thing is that this bridge is gonna give you 0 0.011, 0 0.011 
token, Harmony One tokens, because it's a faucet and you will need it to do your first transaction because uh, you're gonna pay gas fees as one token in the Harmony One network. It makes sense, right? And so the first thing you wanna go is go to SushiSwap and swap some Dai tokens for one. Use the the this kind of uh, one token that you got. Uh, here you can see my wallet that I just uh, bridge some one tokens and you can basically swap those die tokens with one so you can just just put 50 dollars at least so you have some one tokens more one tokens rather than the 0.01 that you got from the bridge so you can use them for uh, transaction fees on the harmony one ecosystem and then you can start using with your uh, harmony one uh, wallet on uh, maybe DeFi kingdom or any other cool DeFi apps or uh, protocols on the harmony one ecosystem blockchain this is the bridge guide from ethereum to harmony one let me know if you have any questions and if it was uh, beneficial for you and you learned something you didn't help you consider clicking the subscribe and bell button and of course joining the discord community thank you so much for learning with, learning, learning with me in Johnny time and i will see you in the next tutorial bye bye